Good morning, ma'am. It's a pleasure to meet you today for an interview. Good morning. Likewise. Tell me about yourself. I am Jeanette Garcia. I live in Hagnaya San Romeo, Cebu. A sophomore student at Cebu Roosevelt Memorial Colleges, taking a Bachelor of Science in Tourism Management. I am passionate about speaking as well as teaching English. I wanted to become a NIASA native camp teacher because in that way I can communicate to a wide variety of people since I am a sociable person. I want to inspire my aspiring students that there is a fun and a great advantage in learning the universal language. I believe I am a good fit for this job because I can speak English fluently and I can make my students feel at ease that makes my teaching way effective. What major problems and challenges did you face in applying for this job? As a college student, this is my first time applying for an ESL teacher and I have encountered challenges such as how to secure a good internet connection and the things needed for this job such as the PC device, but it didn't stop me. I looked for ways to acquire what I have now, for I know these are the requirements needed for this job. What is your greatest weakness? How about your strength? I consider lack of experience as my greatest weakness. But I do believe in a quote that says, you don't have to be great to start, you just have to start to be great. From then on, I started reading and practicing the textbooks at Native Camp. My weakness turned out to be my strength as an inspiration that there is still room for me. A room for improvement and to do the things that I wanted to do. I handle stress and pressure around me by taking one step at everything at a time. I realize that when you are focused, you can achieve your aspirations smoothly. Why should we hire you? I fervently believe that I am qualified as a native camp teacher because I can speak English fluently, which is the most important requirement that I have met. Moreover, I am reliable, smart, kind, as well as funny that will make my students attentive during our lesson. Okay, thank you, Miss Garcia. I will go over your demo lesson that you sent. And once you meet all the criteria, you can expect an email from us no longer than this coming Sunday, November 21, 2021. Thank you, ma'am. Have a good day.